Y'all, it's Manny Tega. It's Manny Manny Re. It is Young Manny. And basically, we're out here about to pop a, cop a fanny. I'm going to pee right here. Sometimes I feel awkward when I pee. I, I don't know exactly what it is. Liquid gold. Liquid gold. Liquid. So basically, uh, if you pee inside of a garden, it's got ammonia and stuff. It's lots of crazy great stuff. Let me get my pants situated. But what I'm going to talk today about is I'm going to talk about some, you know, veganism. Like you go vegan, you feel amazing. What do you eat? You eat squash. You eat, uh, you know, all this stuff, squash, fruits and vegetables, alkaline, Dr. Sebi's food list. And if you don't, you, you're basically making a huge mistake. You know, you attract that which you are. You are who you hang around. Literally, I can feel this more since we're in the age of Aquarius. Um, the great planetary shift i can feel it. it's like you know i am ralph smart and he is me you know what i'm saying it's just because we're both comedic gods like we're so like strong you know and we me and ralph smart we binded souls in our past life so we bought we bonded to almost all almost Ross, the uh, physical body and uh the soul like we were one so Basically, you know, that, that's, that's tells, that just tells you how knowledgeable he is, um, since I'm the committed God of knowledge. And, um, the Finx, the Finx, the Phoenix, the Phoenix and the uh, Raw, uh, Patal, Anu, uh, that's it. So what we got going on, and then Ralph Smart's the committed God, so big, you know, so basically like, uh, so y'all know, but I watched this video and what happened to the cattle, the cow, you know, no labels on any of this stuff, but they put him in a big machine and, and then they slit his throat. Uh, and basically like, you know, I'm not okay with that. You know, I, I will not be having partaking that, you know, in my life. And, uh, you know, I can live off fresh fruits and vegetables. And that's exactly why folk are dying and folk are, are not living long because they're, you know, they're taking in the energy of a cattle getting his, uh, throat cut. And, um, if you want to see that video, you can message me on Instagram and I can send it to you. But basically there is another video of the, of what happens to the, to the pigs. And again, no label on any of this stuff like, um, you know, they get tagged with tattoos, like they get beat, you know, kicked and stuff. And they got to lay in a little box container, a little four, a little like small, um, box. And then, then they get laying on their side. A lot of them get holes rotting in their flesh and stuff. And, uh, then that's why they're pregnant. They get kicked just to move them around. And, um, and then the big ones can get, get hung. They get hung and you see them squirming around. Again, no labels on any of this stuff. Um, but anytime you take, you're taking the energy in, then the babies, they get, um, they get their genitals cut out. Some of time it's improper and they die. And, um, then a lot of times they, you know, they, uh, if they're not growing bigger, bigger fast, they, they get killed. And, um, then they shoot them in the head with a, with a, with a metal rod. Um, and yeah, it's just like that. Uh, you take on the energy is to keep your low vibration, keep you on a low vibration. You take on the energy whenever you, whenever you're doing that, whenever you're like getting that, um, that fear inside you, fear is false evidence of pure real. It's the lowest vibration. And, you know, like I said, I'm not going to be taking part, taking that. And, um, not only that, you know, a pig is a splice with a, with a rat and a rabbit and a, in a hog so it's all these different you know um spliced animal you know is a hybrid uh gmo or whatever so that's what i was gonna share with y'all you know and it's low vibrational you know y'all ain't gonna want to take that in and um that's basically how we how we go you know how we going to go about talking about that and um We'll just let y'all know that and we'll just evolve, evolve, you know. Also, we'll let you know this one other thing I was trying, trying to remember what I was going to talk about. You are who you hang around. 
you know, you know, my mama, she broke my phone. I got a little, I was trying to get a little recording of her backside, you know, by, while she was walking and, uh, she broke my phone. She got at my phone and broke it. But, uh, I was trying to get some pictures of these folk before I left because they're like big, like big and fat, you know, like huge fat. And, uh, basically like that just shows what happens whenever you eat that stuff that comes out of Babylon. Also the manifestation, the spring water, this is the number one manifestation spring water straight out the woods i got some turkey tails turkey tails are great uh protein vitamins and stuff so like water and crystal geyser appalachian spring water i did break some containers last night i sit sit one out in the moonlight when it while it was winter and it froze and busted i sit one on the stove trying to warm it up and it busted and the one beside it busted too so that just give you a couple ideas about not how to not bust them you know, um, other than that, you know, you are who you hang around. And, um, so basically, like I was saying, you know, also your environment and your resources. So it's been hard for me here. So I'll be excited to, to leave, you know, the shed and stuff. I'll show y'all my car. Um, I got so many books that I had bought and I just loaded them up in the car. Um, trying to park it in the shade because a lot of them books got plastic coating on there and i had loaded the car up early and not trying to like uh get all the plastic melting in the sun so it's kind of is sunny in here i don't know but if you really think about it like the whole freaking dash is plastic and stuff so i don't know books loaded up kind of a gen 21 homicide matrix if you really think about it there's 5g um, Nikola Tesla, energy reverse engineered, you know, ancient chemic, uh, energy reverse engineered to go against, uh, the atomic, uh, autonomy and atomic structure, you know, plastic being produced and plastic in the ocean and wars every day that don't solve a thing, just kind of decipher oil out of the, of the planet, you know, which is a living being, the oil or whatever, no label, on any of this is, it's liquid blood carbon. <laughs> And, uh, they're stealing it and using it to make all this plastic petroleum based stuff, which is what you, you know, you really ain't trying to get any plastic on, on you in your growing crop, you know, in your circle. But, uh, that's all that there is out here. Like, you know, they even got a little bat plastic buckets and stuff. Everybody buying all the Christmas wrap, throwing the dowdy. That's another psyop is all the freaking satanic holidays. Uh, you know, <laughs> it's crazy how they, I mean, they put Lucifer and Satan together, but Lucifer is the, the savior figure of humanity. Basically, Inky Osiris, Osor. Uh, no, Inky Osiris. Um, and basically, that's the savior figure for humanity, uh, Archangel Lucifer. And, um, a lot of folk forget that and that's the morning star in the sky so a lot of folk forget that you know uh they want to say like the sun and they're trying to justify this shit around here so i'm just gonna get out of here bro i don't know what to do about it hey, i try i told them everything all the knowledge i i was telling them all the knowledge and they're, they're blatantly nice they're blatantly nice uh nice around here nice and, uh, yeah, just be careful because they was talking about sending me off somewhere. You know, they was like, um, you know, I was packing up to move and they was like going crazy on me. My mom was going crazy on me and talking about she was going to kill herself and she had a property. She was going to leave me. She's talking about she ain't going to, she ain't going to leave me the property and stuff. And, uh, she said she was going to kill me too. She raised her hand up with me. Like I've been going through kind of like some shit, like for a couple of years, I were homeless before I stayed in this shed right here. And, uh, now, like, I hear a lot of yelling and stuff. And grandma just, like, listening to my mama yelling and stuff. And my mama's the planet. I know who my mama's vessel is, Archangel Raphael. Archangel Raphael is my mama. I already told y'all. I ain't got to have a physical vessel. Archangel, Archangel, uh, Raphael brought me into a, a incarnation. Archangel Raphael and Malik. Malika is a father and Archangel Raphael is my mom. Like I said, I'll tell you exactly who all the comedic gods are. You know, Harvey is uh, Horus, Amra, Patal, Archangel Gabriel, Anu, Ralph Smart, 
It's so big. Al Muhammad the third. Young Pharaoh is Thoth. Hermes. Osiris. Uh Enoch. Inky. All the same one. That's infinite abundance. Archangel Lucifer. The son of Mary and Joseph. Very holy. Vaughn to cut. Argonaut and set Anil. That's what she didn't want to see. So, um, basically, Argonaut, like I said, set Anil. If you're looking at Pagoni, Pagoni and, uh, the younger lady is, um, Archangel Raphael, Galileo Galali, Archangel Michael. Archangel, um, there's archangels, there's archangels, and, uh, who else in the, in the committee, um, you know, Jack Lee's on, on Instagram, Jack, Jack Lee's or whatever, Jack Lee, a uh, female, um, is, uh, Lady of Moreau, Ali is, um, Cleopatra, Cleopatra, and who else you got sick, man, you got all the comedic gods are back, all of them. Every God came back. That's going to be it for this episode. Like, uh, put the notification bell on, comment, subscribe. Uh, you can do anything you put your mind to, your heart, your mind. You know, make sure you're growing your hair out. Get that energy, that, that energy that channels out through your hair and your head and stuff so you have your energy and uh, really like not letting that in. I told you all those videos I seen, man. No cap, bro. I seen that. It was it was just like that's that's the truth man i'm grateful i seen it i'm grateful i really could see the truth you know i'm really grateful that truth was brought to me um shout out to harvey harvey sent me that post so basically you know the committed guys are back like a lot of folk watch um who else do a lot of folk watch on here i'm trying to think that's basically it you got thoth so big and uh set and uh they getting a lot of praise on youtube right now uh who else is really out there making videos there's not a lot of folk out yet making videos on youtube um but that's just what i was gonna let y'all know like those gods those deities you know again young pharaoh's thoth her mace and um ralph smart so big on muhammad the third and uh i'm uh archangel gabriel raw anu patal um, holy figure Joshua and Solomon. So, I mean, yeah, you got a shit ton of past life, but ain't nobody got past like the uh, like the committed gods. I don't like this. I don't really love this language, man. You feel the way I explain? I like I like speak like on me. I see a kaya undo. I be some be undo like some like he on me. I see kaya for you to be to ya. Ti huan ti ya. I take kaya do. On me some like he. One day I say a Maya do gan do baya kaya do sambi ti aki do la sambi atu. They got plastic in the ocean without any commotion and bombs that go explosive everywhere. But there's people wearing masks without asking questions in full acquisition to these corporations. And court means their body. Grandma watching the television getting a program saying I'm go to a cult. That is a cult. Many of tell you got so cynical, so cynical. Peace, y'all. Peace, y'all. Peace, y'all. One love. 33. I am you and you are me on Prophecy and Pharisees Deep. Y'all, we gotta, we don't need any 5G because we in the 5D. We ain't having it!